Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make this cool text effect in your new device using Pixart and PSTouch. So without any further ado, let's get started. Alright, so at first I'm going to create a text, you go to edit and type your text, I'm going to type light, just like that, and then, okay, I'm going to make it a bit bigger, and I'm now going to change this font, go to font, my phones, and find the best new regular, and just like that. here it is. You can find the download link in the description below. I'm going to make it a bit bigger, maybe a bit smaller, just like that. Now I'm going to align it. I'm going to relative positions and tap on the middle ones, just like that. Now go to background and choose transparent. Now all you have to do is to save the picture to your gallery. I'm going to choose ultra and save the color all right the second app i'm going to use is photoshop touch but first you have to add your picture for that tap on that icon and go to your gallery folders find your picture to add it let me see where it is here it is select it and press add now you have the picture on your main page now once again tap on the plus icon and choose empty layer done go to the fill and stroke here it is change color to black you have to hold it and drag it all the way up to change the color and ok now i'm going to lower its opacity something about maybe 60 yeah that looks good now once again tap on the plus icon and choose full layer go back and find pixel up folder here it is and choose the picture you just exported from pixel up and add now i'm going to resize it and make it a bit smaller maybe a bit more yeah that looks all right and okay now i'm going to select pixels and hide this layer and choose the black layer and clear now once again tap on the plus icon empty layer done now i'm going to bring it underneath the black layer and fill in stroke change the color to white and change the fill to stroke that's it now choose ok now once again choose the black layer select pixels and choose back the signal layer and clear okay now i'm going to deselect this now go to fx right above there and choose glue change the color to white and I'm going to set it around 50 maybe yeah that looks good and press ok now I'm going to unhide the first layer just like that and press the move icon I'll flip it vertically and bring it underneath the first text align it to the first text I just have to bring it a bit to the right that looks good ok now you have to go and choose warp here it is now tap and hold this corner and drag it all the way up this side and align it to the straight line that just like that and do the same for the other side just like that that looks good and press ok 
Now I'm going to change the layer style to overlay. Here it is. And I'm going to duplicate this layer. Just like that. And then uh, now choose the second layer. Go to effects. Yes, up there. And choose the Gaussian below. And put it to 30. Just tap on that and type 30 and OK. Here it is and tap OK. Now choose back the first layer. Go to fade. Here it is. And choose this horizontally fade and align it until you get satisfied with it. Just like that. Maybe a bit more this side. Yeah, that looks good. Now tap OK. Now you have it all. Just see how it looks with our fade and after fade. It makes it look more natural. And that's what all you have to do to make this cool text effect. Now all you have to do is to save the picture to your gallery. Thanks for watching. Hope you like it. Don't forget to like and subscribe.